Make believe. I'm to push my favorite thing from my fit. Now onto the concealer and I'm using the Rimmel London Wake Me Up in the ivory, in the ivory shade. Some days I need this more than others, but today it's not too bad. This is really now. This time for that, so cute. This is quite a bit Really, really easy to use that for that. It's perfect size. I like to have a bit of tone chin. <laughs> and then it's a little bit long here. Sometimes it gets a bit thick on that, a bit. I'm very very used to using a, a bit of beauty blender for foundation and for concealer. There we go, that's not done for that one. For the contour, I am using a Maybelline and it's a master contour. So a V-shaped dual stick contour and highlight. Now I have used this but I couldn't get the plastic off properly. See that? You can tell I'm... See how I use it. <laughs> 
No, I have quite a prominent jawline, so I don't really need to use the use it along the jawline because for me it just wouldn't do it very well. Now I'm using the contour brush. Make sure it's all kind of blended in really well and evenly. See, I have a lot of scarring on my forehead. Like lots of like dense scars. Because when I was younger, I used to always roll over. And then down there. Probably put a bit too much of the contour that I put. Oh my god. Now time for the brush. And I'm just using the body collection and it's by Body Care. You know, it's right in there. And it's in the rolls, so it's a bit butter. It's very, very shimmery actually, this one. Oh, that's a bit weird to get on there. Well, that really, really, wow, it makes it really pigmented. <laughs> no. So you don't really need a lot on your brush for you. Yeah. No, I'm not going off. Now the brush is the one thing that I really, really struggle with. I know, like you, how much are you really supposed to put on? Because some people put on lots and other people... Well, not so much. See, that's gone a bit too much now, isn't it? But, never mind. Let's be a bit really cheek to that. Now, to let my lips prepare for when I put lip liner and lipstick on, I'm going to put the New Look Prime and Fix Lipstick Base. And it's just in a clear, so, and it goes on like lipstick. Um, they did have other <laughs> shade, but I can't remember what shade that was. Well, I just pressed them really nicely and soft. Mm. Now for the eyeshadow, I'm going to be using the New Look Eyeshadow 12 Shade Palette. Now, I'm sorry it's a little bit um, not so clean, but... It just shows that I use it a lot. And I'm going to be using the this one, this one and this one. Just to show you what they like and how they feel. Okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. No, that's not. I think I've used this on another core and forgot to. Because it's nice and clean. But this is only, you know, I'm just showing you what some of the products are like. Yeah, 
Yeah, we need to start, you know, when I get a chance to start cleaning these bushes as soon as I can before I forget. Then I'll go and use them the next time and they're different. So I just use the white as like a little base. Then using that pink one that I showed you all along the way. And I would tend not to use pink that much really. Because I didn't like pink. I love pink. I was, I'm wearing pink. And I don't really like too much of my eyes because sometimes it makes your eyes look a bit like the red and the, you know, probably infected when really they're not. But, oh. Now I'm just doing this really quickly just to show you the products and a little bit of what I can do. So these are perfect for the day. Now I'm using the dark one, like I said. Now just in the corner here. I said I need a perfect for every day. <laughs> oh, look at my... <laughs> Now look at that, I've got white. Now it could be this brush, it's not really good. But I just kind of want to show you everything really that I've got here. Do I have to take it back? No, it's Now I'm good. <laughs> See ya, come on. It just flow quite heavily. <laughs> just go <'cause> to. Why is <laughs> my voice going that high then? See what I mean? It's always shade coffee, it says. You have to say goodbye. <laughs> no. Which one? And what I will have to do is just. I just put a bit of concealer on there. It's a tiny kind of. There we go. It's got to make sure it's all kind of blended in really well. There we go. Do I have I'm just going to add a little bit of that again, just to... Yeah. 
just a bit low though. I think I have one in there. You always get one really, really good eye, and then the other eye is just like ink the most. So that's that. Now they do apply really, really easily. Um, yeah, I don't know what's going on there, really. But they're <laughs> um, You know, the lovely, the lovely colours, perfect for every day. So, you know, I would go and get it. I would go and get that palette. Uh, you know, if you were going away somewhere, you know, you've got your light. Shades, and you've got your darker shades, you've got your matte, and you've got your, your shimmy shades. So perfect all round. Obviously, uh, the pigment isn't like, you know, a branded makeup range, but they're still good. They're soft on your eyes, easy to apply, and easy to remove if, you, you know, if it falls out. Just make sure you give it a little shake. Now I'm just applying the eyeliner, and this one is just from Avon True Black called eyeliner and it just had like a smudge at the end but I've never really used that so I know I do do it a weird way but it's the best way that I do it for me and the neatest way right. some days I do like a wing liner some days I I just have it normal like to the See my skin because it's so loose it just goes wherever you you put the, the pen. I actually usually do my eyeliner before I put the eyeshadow on and then just do a little bit thin on top. But I've kind of done it the normal traditional way to there for you guys. So you don't think I'm too weird at applying my makeup. <laughs> now time for mascara and now I don't actually have any new look mascaras so I'm using my Avon Big and um, Multiply Times 3 volume mascara. And that's the thing, the tube thing. Do one eye first and then the other. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Go for once more. Oh! <laughs> Great! Really, I should just embrace that. So, you know what? Yeah, I mean, as a mishap, life happens. <laughs> Move on. What's. No, far worse things going on in the world. I've done it again now. Quickly do bottom. Now, would you like me to try out some mascara from New Look? See what it's like. Let me know in the comments if you do. Or you can tweet me on Twitter at DinkyKT. I have really, really short eyelashes because I have a really bad habit of pulling out my eyelashes and my eyebrows. Don't ask me why. I get really anxious and I just sit there and I just do it. 
Can I go on? I think I've got one eyebrow raised, raised higher than the other, I think. I don't know if I'm going to do it. No, I'm just quickly like, doing this. Just to show you what I do. Now I'm tensing the eye. Okay, I got this song in my head. Non stop. I don't know because I keep playing it, but I absolutely love it. Now, you eyebrows don't match exactly like one eye to the other. Remember, they're not identical, they have the one personality. Okay. No, my eyebrows are really annoying me to the other. Do you want to be, is it just me? Or do you have one eyebrow higher than the other? I don't know. I'm using the picture, this pure colour bit highlighter powder and the light pink. And it's beautiful for this. Uh, and that's just so beautiful. Now, obviously, if, depending on how strong you want highlighter, you just apply more. That's down my nose. Now, I personally don't like too much at the end of your nose. Yeah, you keep his bow, right? Just because I can, and I want And then, this is little bush. Just put it on there. Look at that, wow. Normally doesn't come out as much as good as that normally. Well, that is just like whoa, look at that. I'm waiting for it to set up work right now because I feel like it. There you go. How does that look? Time to do my lips to make them look fuller without any plastic surgery and I'm using the new look one in the black cherry Now I'm using two lipsticks now, and they both new look, Mulberry and Crushed Rose, and then the two colours, oh. and I use this, um, uh, I'm doing this really, really fast for you guys, and um, There we go. 
hết mớ Then, using the, the, the crushed rose, just in the middle and my bottom lip, just there. There we go. And that is my fi finished look. And I hope you have enjoyed watching this little tutorial with me. I'm sure many of you know what you're doing anyway, so... Now I'd like to thank you all for watching and if you want more videos like this then please let me know so I can do some more maybe try out different looks, maybe a bit of avant-garde style you know, where it's a bit more fun, a bit more funky and a bit more contemporary whereas this is quite an everyday look for me although I don't always wear eyeshadows <laughs> but I don't always wear mascara either, but that's just me. I'm wearing a Miley Cyrus shirt. I, I, I didn't care that it's Miley Cyrus, I just really like this shirt. I love the colours and it's long so I can wear it, you know, with, with jeggings and just really nice. And it goes with its top, but just throw it on. So, hope you all have a really, really good day and I shall see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.